me show you. So here's all the outfit. You guys, see through. Super duper deep. Oh, let's try that on the pole. Stay on the My wig on the pole. Oh my gosh. It's Lynette again. Currently, it's in the morning. I was planning to like sleep in today. It's uh, already 9.30. I know, I want to sleep in like until probably 11 or 12 o'clock because yesterday I was so tired. I was helping one of my friend's friend to move in from New York. Uh, <laughs> but this morning when I look at my phone, I saw a notification of my ballet outfit. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I have been waiting for two weeks or if not a week and a half now. And I want to try that um, ballet outfit for my pole dancing. Um, I'm not sure if it's going to work, but I feel like um, the ballet outfit, it's pretty... Like if I don't wear the tights um, to cover like the bottom, um, I think I have enough skin to like hold myself on the pole to do like simple tricks and stuff. I'm gonna do like a little bit of like um, unboxing um, kind of like try out kind of video today and also like try to do it on the pole see if it's gonna work. Oh my god you guys that ballet outfit it's so beautiful like um, I, I'm i too excited so I can't even like go back to sleep anymore so I am going to go and check out my mail and bring you guys along with me and unpacking it together oh my god seriously the print on it and the style of the ballet outfit it's so beautiful and this is my first time that i bought from that website it's called lucky leo outfit i think um i'm going to go and get the package and then i'll if i said the name wrong i'm going to update that later when i get the package um but yes it's my first time buying it from the website so hopefully the sizes that i picked is the correct size, otherwise I would be so sad. When I'll be coming home Then I'll be at your door When I'll be coming home I plan to let you know Yes! I got the package! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna um <laughs> I'm gonna unpack this bag. Oh and then the name is Lucky Leo Dancewear. So that's the name and that's the name of the website too. It's Leo Dance Dancewear.com. Actually, let me double check the website name and then I'll update it once I know that it's correct website. <laughs> well, yes, I'm going to unpack this and then I'll show you guys what I ordered or what I got for myself. Um, this should be three bodysuit um, outfit. Spark, oh, what's happening? <laughs> Why are you crying, Spark? But yes, anyways, so it's three bodysuit. Um, technically, I'm ordering, I ordered four bodysuit and a skirt um but the skirt and one of the bodysuit is actually back ordered so i have to wait for them to handmade them it will be shipped in like eight days oh, i can't remember i have to wait for a while for that back ordered to be shipped out um i think by this time they should be done with it now so i just need four them to be shipped out to me but this three is already um, pre-made um, because I, they have this um, event where they pre-made the outfit and they just put it on um, for the website for sale but yes um, I'm going to unpack this three bodysuit outfit yeah! <laughs> what is it? what is it? you just want to hang with mommy? we just wake up we cut off the whole night what are you doing? oh what is it? Hi, lovely. <laughs> come on, come sit with mama. Good job. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. <laughs> so cute. Okay, lay down. Spark, lay down. Thank you. Oh, I love you too. Yes. Good boy. I love you. Okay, stay now. Time to open this. Okay, so technically I'm supposed to get three bodysuits, but there's only two packages. Look at them ribbons! 
So adorable. Oh, okay, I want to open this big package first. Oh, what? this is so cute. This is really cute, guys. I love this. Oh, these um outfit, they're all handmade. Excuse me. <laughs> so these outfit are um handmade individually the little extra details on the package is really cute i really love this oh all right so let me sparky sit thank you say <gasps> i think there are two outfits in here oh my god you guys look at the pattern oh so pretty even the material is really soft it's um I can't remember the material, but majority of the percentage of the material is spandex and this is not like regular like swimsuit kind of like material spandex. It's really soft. I love it. And then this thing here is another outfit. Oh my god. Okay, so I'm just gonna unpack this right now. Um, I just want to show you the little pattern close up. They are so pretty. I am going to um, back to camera up a little bit in a bit after I open this package to show you like what the outfit actually looked like oh the ribbon gets me every time um <laughs> yes oh look at this outfit oh look at this pattern let me show you the full um how the outfits look like when you look at it from afar <laughs> okay Here's the other outfit. Um, so this is the first white one. So the reason why I think this would work on like my pole because it's like, you know, it's like a bikini bodysuit looking kind of thing. So it leaves like um, a good amount of like skin over here for me to be to provide the grip for me on the pole. This, however, for the arm over here, this fabric here, obviously I can't do tricks that needs to like. Um, use my skin to hold me to do the tricks on the pole so this outfit probably I'll do like really simple tricks or like handspring kind of tricks or inverted uh, I'm pretty bad with like tricks names on the pole but um, pretty much it's just like kind of any tricks that doesn't like involve any um, grip um, from the upper arm so yes this is the first outfit I am going to try on um, and this is the second outfit. Oh my goodness, you guys, it's so cute. So that's the front of it. It's like a see-through over here, right? And from the back, oh my gosh, it's like a deep V from the back. And obviously it's like a bikini bottom at the bottom, you know? And I think this outfit would allow me to do some tricks that I would be able to um, hang backward, um, hang upside down and doing some tricks where I need some skin from my back to hold me to do um, those inverted um, tricks. So I think I would be able to do more tricks with this outfit on. So I'm just going to try that in a second later once I try it on. Uh, but yes, this is the second outfit and the third outfit. Oh my goodness, you guys, the color is so beautiful. And this is the front of it. So it's like a wide opened shoulder and the bottom is the same thing, bikini bottom. And from the back, it's a deep V back. I don't know, something about like a deep V back. It's really, I don't know, it's really beautiful. Oh, and also like, um, it has like bust lining. So I think I won't need to wear a bra when I wear this, but we'll see. I feel like the lining is pretty thin itself. So I feel like it might still show my nipple shapes. <laughs> but hey, people gotta deal with it, okay? like. Come on, we all have nipples, guys and girls, like, yes. Okay, I'm so excited to try this. Uh, yeah, I'm going to be right back. You guys, it's so cute. Look at that. Oh my God. Okay, let me put it over here again so you guys can see. Wow, I was a little scared to like order this size. This is a medium size. Um, on their website, it says that their 
product is actually a little on a smaller side so I need to order up a size so um, yeah this is a medium size I don't usually order medium I usually ordered um, small or extra small so I was like oh my god will it fit me but it does look at that you guys it's so pretty let me show you from the back it's a deep oh it's not too deep of a weave for this one but I love it oh my god this is my first time like wearing like a ballet outfit kind of thing so like this is super exciting for me like oh my god I feel so elegant like I can do like ballet poses oh my god but yes this is so adorable so look at the material right here it's really soft and it drapes and it fits my um, armpit really well and the mobility of this outfit is really good so I can do all the tricks you know because it's like it's for ballet dancing so it would allow me to do all the pole tricks and stuff like that so it will you know it will stretch enough for me to do my pole tricks too because all the poses on the pole it's very very um focused on the flexibility of the body and this this outfit is perfect oh my god okay so this is the first outfit the quality of the sewing and everything it's really good um, the only thing that kind of bothers me is right here because I have such an OCD in terms of like how things will fall and stuff. However, since this is not aligned, but they equally did the same thing over here. So that gives me like a satisfaction of like, okay, at least it matches on both sides. So it's not big of a deal. This outfit, oh my gosh, let me try the second outfit. And this is the second outfit. The one that is see-through in the middle right here so beautiful and this is the deep v back wow so pretty and the mobility i was kind of concerned of like a deep v um back because of like you know the poses that i would do on the pole it might slip off my shoulder but again this is a ballet outfit so the pole poses and tricks, they are very similar to ballet kind of um, poses. Um, so I feel like it won't and it doesn't. It works perfectly. This outfit is really beautiful. However, if you guys can see here, it's a see-through. I have my undergarment on. So just in case the sizing does not fit me or something so I can do a return to keep it like hygienic, <laughs> you know, but as you can see, you can actually see through the fabric over here to see my undergarment. So I am a little concerned if I were not to wear my undergarment here, it would actually show what's underneath. You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> but yes, uh, I think uh, I really like the design of it even though over here is kind of like a see-through kind of material um, I'll probably wear like an outside skirt you know like most ballet dancers they have like um, an external skirt for them to wear which I already ordered too um, which it's going to come in the next couple days or in a week or so so um, I think that should be fine uh, but yeah, I think this outfit will let me do my pole tricks as well. I think I'm happy with this one too, even though I'm not like 100% because of the see-through, because it makes me really nervous, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yes, off to the third outfit. This is the third outfit. Looking on the website, I thought like the lower V back is very similar to the previous outfit, but this one that's super duper deep V. Oh my god. <laughs> it's beautiful. Oh my goodness. How elegant is that? It has like a open neck kind of um, top. However, I feel like I have the tendency to do this. So the top of the, the opening of the neck will go like this. But um, I have to stretch the neck open like this more. It gives me like unstable kind of feeling. It hanging off my shoulder a little bit. So since it's like a very deep V, I'm not quite sure if it's going to stay 
But then again, it's a ballet outfit. It should stay. But this one, it kind of feels a little bit more unstable. So I'm going to try to do some tricks with this outfit. All of the three outfits in a second. So I will see how it goes. Also about the bust lining. Uh, it's really tight here. Even though it's like it's really thin. Um, kind of like lining but since it's really tight you can't really see the nipples it's really good you kind of like see it a little bit but it's not like too obvious someone would notice it or like really see it unless they really freaking stare at your boobs you know like and nobody's gonna do that in public but you'll be surprised people would do it but either way it's not too obvious but yes <laughs> let's give these outfit a try on the pole Woo! <laughs> Okay, it's time to try the outfit. <laughs> Little spark. Um, it's time to try the outfit on the pole. Um, so let's see how that's gonna go. I just put my hair in the bun right here, so it won't get in the way. Uh, since I'm already on this outfit earlier, um, so I'm just going to try this outfit first, and then we'll go backward on the rest of the outfit. So let's do that. Okay. You guys already know, precautions really. Really important is to make sure your pole is nice and clean before you get on top of it as per normal procedure. Very simple trick to just like spin on it and do like a uh, inverted butterfly with it. So um, since it has like an open back, I'm going to try some tricks that involves like that needs some back skin to hold me on the pole. I don't know if that makes sense because I'm like self-taught in pole and I don't really remember the names of the tricks. Let's go, let's try to do that. Okay, so the top does not fell off my shoulder even though it's um it's really at the edge of my shoulder and let me try to do tricks with my back okay yes it works because the open back really leaves enough skin for me to like hold myself on the pole so this is perfect as I planned. You don't need to get off the pole now. <laughs> okay. Woo! Woo! Wow, okay. Being on the pole and trying to talk at the same time is really hard. Oh my god. Hi lovely. It was really hard and especially when I'm like upside down too. <laughs> I need to like Catch my breath. Wow. Okay. And my hair is off the bun now. <laughs> Whew. Okay, that was fun. I am so excited. Wow, my hair is a mess. <laughs> this is so exciting. This outfit actually really works for pole dance. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so elegant. Um, I have been like trying to shop for like the proper pole outfit for a while, and lots of like pole dance outfit does not really fit my personality because it's very either very sensual which i don't think i am because i'm such an awkward turtle and some outfit it's very aggressive and like very progressive kind of like look too which i don't think i have that vibe too um even though my thinking is very progressive but it's like the way I carry myself does not reflect that. And some other pole outfit, they are very sporty, very like acrobatic or like gymnastic kind of like feel to its look, which I don't think it is my, um, it does not really reflect my personality too. Because when I do pole dance, I feel like I focus more on flexibility, gracefulness, and um, the flow of like the tricks. So I feel like I want to try like a ballet outfit to see like if it would, you know, work on the pole. Because I feel like ballet outfit, like things that I do on the pole that's like really graceful and really remind me of like ballet kind of like um, style. So that's why I have been like looking at different like <laughs> ballet outfits and stuff. So I landed on this website. Uh, which I found out on Instagram. So uh, if you guys want to um, check it out, I'm going to leave the link in the description box below so you can check out their website too. They're based in Denver. Uh, they're all handmade and each fabric is very delicately selected by 
the owner and some of the fabrics they actually were or I mean not the fabric itself but like the design of um, the patterns of the fabric <laughs> it's actually designed by the founder herself I think um, if I remember it right it was founded by two sisters who were ballet dancer I don't know if they still do ballet dancing right now but they all they, they are both um, ballet dancers so they really designed their um, outfit that is truly fitted for like the activity that it is going to be used for but yes <laughs> all information aside let's try the rest of the two outfits on the pole and see how that goes okay so this is the third outfit it's the one that's see-through at the center and at the bottom that's kind of like see-through a little bit let's go backward a little bit for you guys to see so um since i'm going to keep this outfit anyway so i try to wear this without my undergarment so it turns out it's not too bad like you can't really see through you can't really see what's underneath it <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I think I'm happy with this. I really love the color, but I'm not really sure how it's gonna feel or look on my skin. It kind of does look like um, a nude color, but I love pink so much, so I think I'm just going to keep it anyways. It's really beautiful on my skin, even though it looks kind of like naked. Either way, um, I'm planning to have like a steward on this one anyway, so, and now we're just going to do um, some tricks on the pole. This one, it's really, um, it has some like back opening and enough skin under my armpit and also like, you know, the bikini bottom that leaves a lot of skin for me to like be able to do pole tricks. So let's try that on the pole. <laughs> I am thinking of doing some tricks that involve the grip that is under the armpit to see like if this is going to work. So we'll see. I'm just gonna hop on the pole and really like do whatever tricks that comes to my mind. Um, <laughs> it's for grunting. While trying to figure out if I can use my underarm and skin to like do my tricks. So we'll see. Uh, let's do... Mm, I think I know. Let's do like a handspring and then I'll transition it to some other pose. Um, and we'll figure it out from there. Okay. So, I'm using my skin under my armpits here. It's, it actually requires more skin on the back but seems like the fabric is actually in the way so I'm not quite sure if it's going to help me stay on the pole <laughs> but seems like it does but it's only like half half of my skin that is able to like help me stay on the pole or maybe I'm just like really bad at pole dancing. <laughs> so what happened was, um, so I'm, I'm able to use the skin over here to hold myself. However, I still need to like um, put the pole right over here. So this fabric right here is actually kind of like in the way. So I feel like, I think it's just like my way of doing the tricks, I think. Because now that I think back, um, most pole outfit, they do have fabric over here. How are you gonna design an outfit that has no fabric over here? Like, So I think I'm just kind of like need to learn how to do my tricks better. Um, <laughs> this outfit actually really good because it has open back as well. So I can do like my pole tricks that requires like the back of my skin to actually hold my weight on the pole. And pretty much the bottom of it is like the same thing. It's like bikini bottom, so you have enough skin to hold yourself. Um, but yeah, this outfit actually works as well. So this is, this is good. Yes, oh my god. Let's move on to the third outfit, yes. And this is the third outfit. Um, in terms of like the pole dancing itself, I think this outfit is going to be a lot more restrictive in terms of like what tricks I can do. So um, because of like the fabric over here and also like there's not a lot of skin on the back for me to do the pole tricks. I'm just going to do like upward kind of tricks and use a lot more of my grip 
and also like my leg to do the support of my weight on the pole. Let's go in to try that out. <laughs> so technically I could do this trick right here. And all of the tricks that is upward. Um, let's do this one. Do that. <laughs> oh, I don't know what I can do. A little genie. is it for the ballet <laughs> outfit try out on the pole and unboxing and reviewing yes I'm really happy with this purchases um, I'm super excited to do more tricks on this and making more pole dance video for you guys on this outfit because they look really really elegant and it has such a nice flow to it I just love the way it looks <laughs> the way it allows me to convey my way of dancing which um, is something that I really want to do to convey like a gracefulness and really beautiful form and style of pole dancing rather than like aggressive kind of like sporty kind of like look to it so I hope you guys enjoy this little video oh my god my hair is such a mess let me put that down real quick I hope you guys enjoy this little video of reviewing this ballet outfit kind of thing I'm going to do another one when the rest of my order comes in with the little skirt and um, another um, back ordered uh, bodysuit so yes um, let me know in the comment section below if this information really helpful for you and I hope you guys I don't know if you guys do pole dance too or you do ballet dancing I hope um, this little review about this product help you guys make a good decision as well um, once again I'm a really petite person I'm 5'2 um, in height and I am a hundred pound in weight and the sizing that I ordered for this is medium size and I'm going to leave their website in the description box below if you guys want to check it out. Pricing wise, I feel like for its quality, what function that it would allow me to do in terms of like mobility, the fitting and the feel, the fabric quality, I think it's worth it to invest in those kind of outfits because I feel like I'm going to use this a lot for my pole practices and um, pole dancing videos and stuff like that so it really depends on you I hope this video is enjoyable and also informational and like give you the right information for you guys to like make your own decision in terms of like purchasing your own outfit so until then I'll see you in the next video bye